Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak uh, 3.0 firmware, the official one, not the beta, obviously because it's out, everyone should have it. Um, this works for Windows and Mac, I'm doing it on Mac, but it's the same process on a Windows. Links to Red Snow, which is the application I'll be using to jailbreak, are on the right of this video in the description. So I'm just going to launch Red Snow, open, and this is a very self-explanatory application shouldn't really need to follow this, you really should just go download Red Snow and do it yourself. But just in case you want to be um, safe, you can follow what I'm saying. So you need to go browse to the right firmware. Mine's on my desktop. And here is the 3.0 Restore. Processing firmware identified. Downloading kernel. Preparing jailbreak data. Uh, yes, you do want to install Cydia, obviously. So make sure that your device is off and plugged into the computer. So now I'm going to turn off my iPod. And yes, you need to have your iPod in um, in a fresh restore of 3.0. So now it is off, and you say if it's not off, plug your computer in first, then turn it off. So, yep, just follow, click next, hold the power button in the corner for one second. Without releasing the power button, also hold down the home button for four seconds. Keep releasing the home, without releasing the home button, release the power button, but keep holding the home for four seconds. Or for whatever amount of seconds. I think I'm out of, oh, okay, I did it right. Um, that kind of just runs at you, or that's not really the right way to say it, but, like, it comes out at you, so you gotta be ready to do that, but it shouldn't be hard. So now I can release this, uploading RAM disk, and over here you can see it says downloading jailbreak data. Again, this is very simple, it's not gonna take a long time at all either. This is a light jailbreak, so it only installs Cydia, but you can get IC through Cydia, so that shouldn't be a problem. And it's already done, it should now reboot, and you can click finish on Red Snow. So you're done with the computer. Now all we need to do is focus on the iPod. And it's jailbreaking, flashing NOR, who the hell knows what that means, but not important, yes. So, it's pretty much unnecessary keep watching this video but I'm just gonna show you that it does in fact jailbreak and it works so I'm gonna keep the video up but you guys know how to do it now so you can go uh, jailbreak your iPods now this works for everything except the iPhone 3GS the brand new one works for iPod touch G1 G2 and iPhone G2 and G3 or 2G and 3G my bad so installing bundles, after it's done with this, it just pretty much reboots, and then Cydia will be right there. Again, I already mentioned this, but you do have to have a um, fresh restore of 3.0 on your device before you start this. This is taking a little bit of time. But now, as you can see, the progress bar is going, and hopefully it'll finish up. Syncing file systems. Rebooting. So now the device is rebooting. As you can see, there's the Apple logo. I don't know why I felt like doing that, but I did. And as you can see, slide to unlock. And next page, there's Cydia right there. Jailbroken on 3.0. As you can see, there's the search thing. So if you like videos like this, please subscribe for more tutorials coming very soon. And uh, also follow my Twitter link in the description. And thank you for watching.